So you've stayed at this hotel? I don't want any pizza. See? Pain in the ass. Well, we can get something else. I don't want anything. I'm not hungry. Well, what's the matter? My friends were supposed to play Dungeons and Dragons with me, but they canceled. Aw, I'm sorry. We can play with you. Really? Dale, that's nice, but I don't think you'll like it. Afraid I might beat you? Actually, there's no one winner. It's a cooperative game where you use your imagination to explore a fantasy world with the help of the Dungeon Master's pre-planned scenarios and the rolling of polyhedral dice. Still sound fun? Yeah. Sort of. So how does this work? You start by creating your character. I want to be a Ninja Turtle Princess of Power. <laughs> Put me down for that, too. You have to choose from one of the character classes. There's Thief, Druid, Paladin, Wizard. Ooh, Wizard. I want that. All right. Then I'll use my magic to turn me into a Ninja Turtle Princess of Power. No. Well, wait, wait, what's a Paladin? A Paladin is a holy knight who crusades in the name of good. Oh, I like that. I want to be that. Really? Yeah, I've been meaning to do more crusading in the name of good. Okay. You say you got Thief on that list? I'll be a thief. That sounds like fun. You enter a dark and musty crypt. Torches along the walls fill the room with a flickering light. In the center of the room is a mysterious glowing chest. What do you do? I open the chest. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's a chest in the middle of a crypt. It's a little suspicious, don't you think? I don't know. I'm not even sure to cryptos. Ah. It could be booby-trapped. Thieves have the ability to check for traps. Good for me. I can do that. Hold it. This chest does not belong to us. So? I'm a paladin. It's not a very paladin-y thing to do. You didn't want to steal the key. You didn't want to fight the goblins. You wouldn't even kill the spider. You put it in a cup and took it outside. Well, that wasn't in the game. I know. It was in real life, which is worse. Could me and your me ma have a little privacy, please? We can leave, but we're still gonna listen. Also, you find no traps. What is your problem? You act like Mr. Goody Two Shoes, and you expect me to believe that's real? Yeah. Well, I don't. Sheldon said there were no traps. What happened to you? You used to be fun. Come on, I'm playing this stupid game with your grandkids. That's rude. Cut the crap. We both know this isn't you. No, I can't win with you. What does that mean? Forget it. No, I'm not going to forget it. Talk to me. I don't want to. Missy, help me out here. Communication is important. I learned that in the Fresh Prince show. No. I asked you to marry me, and you turned me down flat. Are you still mad about that? Oh, hell yeah, I'm still mad about that. He proposed. He just said he did. Pay attention. And you didn't even take it seriously. I didn't take it seriously because you were drunk. That's when I'm the most honest. You can ask anybody at the bar. OK, fine. That still doesn't change the fact that I'm not interested in getting married again. Why not? I don't have to explain myself to you. I'd like to know. And I'd like to play D&D. We've been through this. I like my life just the way it is. And if you can't work with that, then, well, well, what? Tough knuckles. Whoa. Huh. Well, that's good, then. I don't have to pretend to be Mr. Water drinking nice guy anymore. That's what I've been trying to tell you. <laughs> yeah. Well, will you all excuse me? Where are you going? I'm going to get myself a beer. <laughs> So you're standing in a crypt looking at a lock chest. What do you do? Pull a beer out of it. Get out of my way. I'm a thief and I'm opening this chest. I have at it. I'm a paladin with a buzz on. Success. The chest opens revealing a scroll with ancient writing in a strange language you don't recognize. What do you do? I say this is boring and turn myself into a Ninja Turtle Prince of Power. This game just got good. High five. Yeah.